Henry in Oklahoma, quickly. I'm Larry O'Connor. You're on the Savage Nation. How you doing? Um, hey. I used to live just like you. I lived in uh, outside of Detroit in Dearborn, hometown of you know, Ford Motor Company and so forth. Sure. And I watched the same thing you did happen. I had, all, I had tons of friends who, you know, as they grew up, uh, went into the auto industry, uh, good best friends working in the tool and die. And, uh, you know, I had the same thing happen to them. You know, it was great for a few years, and then, boom, auto industry goes in the crapper. And these guys are without jobs. Uh, you know, they work one week on the job and for a motor company. They go two weeks off the job and go on employment, one week on, two weeks off. And, uh, you know, and it took, it took years for these guys to find jobs. And when they finally did, they had to take, obviously, massive pay cuts if they were lucky to find a job at all. Yeah. Hey, and, and let's not forget, gone. I mean, and remember all the companies, remember the unions, uh, in some cases, the unions allowed companies to go bankrupt and go out of business and everybody was out of work yep. rather yep. than take some sort of what they consider a give back. It was, just, it was Twinkie Nation all over again, remember, just like the Twinkies. Exactly. And I watched this guy, like I said, my best friend's company, you know, they were based in England. They had, they did two and die stuff for him. They built, you know, all kinds of different things. But anyway, their company, it wasn't, it wasn't profitable for them to stay in Michigan anymore because they just couldn't afford it. They, yep. the, the, the unions made the, the wages way too high and benefits and so forth. And so they bailed. Yeah. Hey, thanks for calling. For them to stay there. Thanks for calling the Savage Nation. Thanks for calling 855-400 Savage. Uh, yeah, what's happening in Michigan right now is exactly what Michigan needs to do. They need to be able to do whatever they can to help industry. They need to be able to do whatever they can to get people working again. It's been decades. It's been decades since that state has had any kind of economic performance. And you now have a Michigan state, uh, you got a Republican state Senate, you've got a Republican state legislature, and you've got a Republican governor. That didn't happen by accident. They're done. They're done. And you see thugs from these unions. You know, we'll be back. We'll be back after this. But we're going to talk about what these unions have done in the Capitol building. They're living there right now. They've stormed the place. They won't go away. They're pushing people around. You got it all on video. Welcome to the next four years of Barack Obama's second term. I'm Larry O'Connor in for Michael Savage. It's a Savage Nation.